Well, day two <coughs> out here. Saw some grass as I was driving. Thought I'd make a few casts in it, but it'd start off our morning. We can't catch fish. It's a little bit of grass out here, not much, but it doesn't mean there won't be fish in it. Good. Oh, <laughs> that's a four pounder. I think I can get it. Swim, you sucker. <laughs> I don't think I need to visit. I didn't catch it that deep. Hang on, he's just being a turd. I guarantee he's being a turd. He doesn't realize he's back in the lake. There he goes. See, I told you. <laughs> he's like, I'll just lay here. I'll just lay here for a minute. Doo -de doo do doo. Turd. All right, we got our first fish of the morning. Good, almost a four pounder. Yay. Let's see if we can get more on here. You might want to hit Mark. I just did, sir. <laughs> you know what? You probably both did that one. He's just two and a half. Uh, two here. Yeah. Pretty quick. Yeah. 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 Can't complain, can we? Nope. Look at you, son. Bigger. 
Ja, det er der. Ja. Yeah. Hvor Saw that splash. What? I'm big. I got it. I got it. I just let it off. Just a little. What? Just a little. Oh, you got another one with it. Three, four with it. Come on, hurry, hurry. I think I had one grab me and then there, because there was more there, you know, unfortunately none of them are really big. <laughs> Little turd. Andrew oh, went nice off one. and dropped one down on me and caught one as I just caught one. But he didn't turn on my, oh my gosh, that's good. Look at this fish. Get wet. <laughs> Get wet, boy. Just come here. Just come to my hand. It's all be over. <laughs> that three, three and a half pounder, dude. <laughs> I cast out there, catch one, and That's he decides to get up and cast. That's what he did. He's like, oh, dad's got one on. So he finally. That's what I'm gonna do during the tournament as long as Just I wait got. for him to catch one. What if they don't catch one? As soon as they as soon as they both flip a little one, I'm just gonna pitch right in there and catch one. Cause that one was behind the console too. I pitched it forward, but it, I both flipped it like a 13 incher, and then he throws right out there and catches a three and a quarter, three and a half Yours pounder. Yours is like a 14 incher. Still, whatever. And then he didn't want to turn the camera on for me because he was well, too interested said, in flipping in there. You said, "Oh, it's a, it's just small," which is <laughs> which, which usually whenever it's small, you usually just say, "Don't worry about the camera." Go hit mark. Giant. What is this thing? It's a pig. I always want a boat to fly.
Naruto in there and pin that sucker. Mm. Yeah, yeah. It's a three. Huh? It's a three. It's a three, yeah. Probably all the same one. You know, probably just got twins. I had a really big one on earlier. It was probably in the fives, but he hit me right at the boat and and I let too much slack on him and he and he threw the hook, so and I never really got a anything in him, but uh that was more my fault than it was uh, anything I know what I did. But it's been a good day so far. Kinda right here. I think I have a starting spot, maybe. I ain't got no pressure. I can do this by myself. Little things like that. You know, we're only gonna have one practice video. I'll probably just do two days worth and the rest of them will just be us fishing. I'll probably only run the camera here for this and then on the tournament, of course, I'll film quite a bit. So, but this is, this whole thing's been really good and I need to retie now because that's, I've caught, what, a limit? So, I have a limit for. I have a limit for about eight. And I have a limit for about 15, 16 pounds again, like I did yesterday. So. If you count that big one, you have eight. Yeah. Well, if I caught that big one, yeah. If I'd have had it in my hand, I. But. Um, I just reached out for it and I, my rod dropped. And it just came off. So I dropped my rod. And it lost all ten, lost all tension on it. So, I mean. Kind of crazy we're getting some decent marks out here i can't complain about that i'll probably need to put a new one of these on but i mean it's a simple drop shot setup i'll fill my hook here but you know coming out here and fishing these st Clair smallies you know you gotta keep mindset of line mostly because of uh you know, the zebra mussel down there, but you catch a lot of fish and they've got a lot of sharp teeth, so they're not, you know, because they're, they're eating other fish. They shake their heads a lot, Gail. Shake, you, yeah, you know, a lot of shaking. Line snagged up. Let's test Maybe this hook up. out here and see if we can got a nice tip still. Oh yeah, we can still use this hook. <laughs> but, I'm using a one-aught drop shot hook. And if you look at it, see how it's got that straight, instead of rounded that digs and that when that gets in there to there it don't throw it'll bend the hook before it throws it and um so you just got to really this hook right here by maruto which you can get at anglersinnovations.com and you go there and get you a one aught you know you have your options you got ones and one aughts and i was catching walleye on this yesterday and then today I'm catching, you know, I haven't caught a walleye yet, but I was catching decent walleye and decent bass with it yesterday. So the hook size does not affect a lot of these Great Lake fish. So you don't need, I'm using 10 pound test anyway. So, I mean, I don't want to monkey around with that light stuff and it, it doesn't bother the fishing. So I think 10 pound test gives you optimal pull, set hook, set power, all that stuff. And strength when you need it out there and, and i mean everybody's different they all think they need to have that super light line but i don't and here you know i use a tungsten weight for a drop shot only because uh the profile is smaller than an and i'm throwing half ounce so a lot of times that stuff is i tied a knot you got to tie a knot in it so when you put your bait on and you put your stuff through it's best to tie a knot so that they can't throw your weight when they're fighting you because they will jump jerk and then you'll have three or four with it potentially and then they'll pull at the weight so um other than that that's what it seems like it's really working well for me and um there's my knot just don't want them throwing it I'm using about a 14 inch leader and and uh, just be mindful of your line that's all you got to do call the wind baby <laughs> Turn, Andrew. he threw back in there and got my fish he chased me up no fair
<laughs> got your cold. face all wet, did it? That water is cold. <laughs> Look out, Andrew. That thing is a vicious beast. <laughs> that's, not, that's not nice. <laughs> Do you see that fish? Burrito <laughs> hooks, got him. Got him twice. Huh? Got him twice. Little thing. Yeah. Back flip. Do a flip! <laughs> got me. What happened? What was that for? <laughs> oh, <I'll> just... <laughs> Shut off the secret bait. Oh no. That probably 20 people are throwing. 20? What? 20? Yeah. Oh, 50% of the field? Not this one. <laughs> Three and a half for sure. That's a little bit bigger than three and a half. Just a little bit. <laughs> Yay me. But I got a mark. Yay me. Big ass birdie. Straight down. Good job.
get these things around, we're going to probably end up making this our last fish of the day. It ain't that big, but it's a two and a quarter pounder. A lot of casting for fish out here sometimes. Not finding any massive schools or anything like that. It's kind of sad, but horrible. Sad and horrible at the same time. But if you cast it in front of one, they'll bite it. Like they're not chasing or doing much like that, but I think me and the boy might go look at some of the Great Lakes tomorrow. I'll film. We'll look at the map tonight. And see what we do. But I have a starting spot in two different areas. seems more vast so I'll leave it at that anyways guys I uh, hope you enjoyed some of this practice and I hope the tournament is better subscribe please pull the win I'll get out of here man. Thanks.